Yo Lantru and welcome to another exciting day in our galaxy and welcome to another episode of our little A to Z officer series. And today we will talk about T'Pol. She's a rare officer and of course as usual we, we have a look at the general stats. She's class science which makes sense as science officer of the Enterprise. And that means you need science badges to upgrade her. She's from the group Enterprise NX01, so she can give synergy to a captain of that group. And she's, uh, if she's on the bridge, and she's Faction Federation, which means you need Federation Faction credits to upgrade her. And if you haven't seen Enterprise, and I know some people still haven't, although I think uh, there's a number of episodes which are really nice, so you th should think about it. Like for every officer, there's an explanation text here in the info box. She's from a series. She's one of the main characters. And so there's a longer text in here. And if you don't know Enterprise, then have a look. As you could already hear, she does not have a captain maneuver, but she does have an officer ability and a below deck ability. And both at that time when they invented uh, the whole Enterprise arc, I was quite happy to, to have someone helping with mining again. As you can see, she is deployed on one of my ships. The officer ability is threats are illogical. And T'Pol increases protected cargo by 70% of base. So you can use her for more protected cargo. I've got a lot of officers for that on my ship. So I'm using her below deck on one of my ships. And that's because of her ability Vulcan Hydraulics. T'Pol increases ore mining speed by 50% of base. So I gave my ore mining a little push here besides um, the Ston and, and Borg Ston um, parts. I gave another kick via the below deck abilities. That's why I do like the below deck abilities. In the early times when I played this game, the officers were only there to add some more to attack, to defense, to health. But um, since they introduced the lower decks officers, they bring real abilities. And that is a nice thing that came in. You, that, you know that there's a lot of new stuff that's not so nice and not so much um, helping with getting your grind done. But that was really an improvement to the game that I really liked. And that's how I'm using her. But of course, as a rare officer, she also does have two possible traits for away teams, that's scientist and analytical. Both are not that rare, so um, she's not that missed because I did not unlock that, um, especially because of the fact I have her on below deck on one of my ships um, the whole time, so I will not unlock that either. Until recently, on the question how to get her, I would have had to say... Um, yeah, you can't, uh, except outside of special events. Meanwhile, they made it possible to get her. And for this, we have to go to the Mirror Universe refinery, though, and here to the Liquid Trillium D store. There is the Annex01 crew exchange. And here you do find um, T'Pol. For one chest, you have a chance to get one, two, or three T'Pol shards for, for one exchange. And uh, you either can exchange one chest or two chests and uh, see if you can get some because the NX01 crew is in here and that's uh, finally a nice addition. They at least had something to do with the Mirror Universe. If you um, remember the double episode with Archer um, fighting the Tholians and uh, stealing the Defiant that came from the future and from another universe. So, um, that is at least making a little sense here. But that's your way of getting to Paul uh, frequently. So um, you might want to choose doing that. We can just have a quick look what happens if I click one chest. Yeah, I only got Phlox and, and Shran, but still uh, one Phlox shard, two Shran shards. And so you have you will need some um, patience here. But the cooldown time is 20 hours, so um, that's okay. If you want to tell us how you use T'Pol, please write it in the comments on YouTube or um, on Discord. And if you're not on Discord yet, then um, have a look in the pinned comment. Every one of my viewers is welcome there. And if you want to see another video right now, the next one is right here in the end screen. I'll see you there. I'll be back.